Now with a look at all the stories making the headlines this Tuesday, it's the ITV News at 10. An existential challenge to the West, the Home Secretary ups the rhetoric on illegal migration. Suella Braverman, a child of immigrants, said multiculturalism had failed and that it may be time to rip up the global rules on refugees. We will not be able to sustain an asylum system if, in effect, simply being gay or a woman or fearful of discrimination in your country of origin is sufficient to qualify for protection. I think the Home Secretary has totally failed to tackle the Tories' asylum chaos, so she's ramping up the rhetoric and looking around for someone else to blame. The speech lauded by some has prompted fury from opponents, which is presumably just what she's hoping with one eye on a future leadership bid. Anushka has been travelling with the Home Secretary and will give us her analysis. Also on News at 10 tonight. On the trail of the Vietnamese traffickers exploiting those desperate to get to the UK. I'm going to be wearing this hidden camera. I want to get on the record exactly how these smugglers operate and how they're getting people into the UK. The battle starts in a battleground state. Joe Biden becomes the first US president to join a picket line. Guess who's pitching up tomorrow? Seen any of these treasures? The British Museum's plea for more than a thousand artifacts still thought stolen and... The best is yet to come. Getting under his skin, the new Sinatra musical His Daughter Tells Us honours his first wife's role in his success. This is ITV News at 10 with Julie Etchingham. Good evening. Even by Suella Braverman's own standards, it was an uncompromising speech on illegal migration. The Home Secretary was calling for a profound sea change in attitudes prompted by the small boats crossing the Channel, and not just attitudes in Britain, but around the world. Seeking asylum and seeking better economic prospects are not the same thing, she said. She claims the reason the world has allowed such drift in thinking is the fear of being branded racist. Dismissing those who are worried by illegal migration as bigots is unfair and dangerous, the Home Secretary told her audience in America. The United Nations was having none of that. It issued a highly unusual rebuke, saying there was nothing wrong with its convention on refugees and the UK should do better at reducing its asylum backlog. Glorious, and that is all for tonight. The details of Storm Agnes are coming up in the weather and a little later after that. On assignment is back for a new series of reports from America, Turkey, and I've been to Germany. Join Raggy for that, but from all of us, that's News at 10 for tonight. Good night. We'll see you tomorrow. There's a serial killer on the loose. It looks 